Meet Alice. Lately, she's been experiencing blurry vision, headaches, and trouble with balance. Her doctor is concerned and collaborates with the team neurologists who orders an MRI scan. Alice's care team assembles to review her case. The team uses Alice's virtual twin to assess her case. It is clear to the medical team that Alice has a form of brain cancer requiring immediate intervention. After simulating options, they determine that radio surgery is the best approach. The hospital has been receiving training on a new radiotherapy device. Alice learns she has cancer. That shocking news is lessened by her care team explaining her treatment options, using her virtual twin to help her visualize what's going to happen next. Alice experiences the non-invasive radiotherapy procedure in virtual reality and her apprehension is alleviated. Meanwhile, motivated by a close friend with brain cancer, Michelle, a scientist at a bold new biotech, is working on a new targeted treatment that kills cancer cells. Using a 3D model of protein on the cancer cell, Michelle is able to target just the tumor. Michelle is part of a team piloting a new device that allows patients to be treated in the comfort of their own homes. Working with Thomas, a biomedical engineer, they use a virtual twin to design a device that delivers and monitors the treatment. The treatment is now ready to test in patients. The clinical trial team scans massive data sets to design the trial. They create a population of virtual patients called a synthetic control arm that will cut the number of patients they need to recruit in half. Using AI, the clinical trial team finds that the response rate was higher in patients who had radio surgery. They use this insight to recruit sites and patients. With the new drug delivery device, the team decides to run a decentralized trial with a combination of site visits, telehealth sessions, and at-home patient monitoring, including quality of life journaling. Now it's time to recruit doctors and patients. Dr. Roberts learns of the clinical trial as an oncologist who uses radio surgery. Alice hears of the breakthrough therapy through a patient support group and registers for the trial from her phone. After conferring with Dr. Roberts about potential adverse reactions, Alice is approved for the trial. She receives a package containing the treatment and sensors to monitor her progress. Eagerly, she begins the treatment, logging how she's feeling each day and sharing her progress with her doctors and the clinical trial team. With the patient's virtual twin, and the dedication of patients. Doctors and researchers working to understand, diagnose, and treat the most complex diseases, life-saving treatments can be approved quickly and delivered with minimum risk. By using the patient's virtual twin, doctors can determine the best treatment plan. And patients who hear you have cancer can feel more secure, focus on their treatments, and live healthier lives.